really speak for the defense, but uh, offensively, yeah, I think we had, um, you know, we had some some missed opportunities. I, I fumbled once. Um, you know, just little things like that. Just, we got to clean up, and it's a it's a different game. Uh, dependable, man. Like he, he's, you know, you give him the ball, you always know that you're going to get something out of him. But, um, you know, you can see it all throughout the week. He's a hard worker. Uh, he's the same guy every single day. Um, and so that really speaks for his character and then uh, also how he plays on the field. What's the mindset going to next week playing against Tulane on the road? Uh, to win. I mean, it's the same as, as every week. And um, we know they're a good opponent. And, uh, you know, but that doesn't change for us. I mean, we have to do our job. And, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's not who we play. It's how we play. And, um, you know, that's what we're going to do. Um, what do you think of the run-heavy play calling, especially in, like, the first half? Uh, I mean, I don't know. That's, uh, that's up to them, and that's, that's their job. And I think when you have running backs like Kevin Hart, I mean, uh, you know, it makes sense. Uh, and we have a great O-line. So, uh, I mean, I get it, and I trust whatever, whatever they call. So. Is it tough? You guys had, like, a, a, a lot of drives to the 35, to the 45. You were in between a lot of times when, you, when they sent the punt team out there. Is that tough, how you kind of almost get in scoring range and have to – Give it up. Yeah, exactly. That's, I mean, what I was telling him, like, it's just, you know, we're in such good field position, and a lot of the time we just couldn't capitalize on it. It just kind of seemed like we stalled out, like, right outside of field goal range. And, um, you know, I guess it's just everybody. I mean, someone just makes one more play, then we get a first down, and then we're in scoring territory. So, um, but again, I mean, we got the ball at that point, so it's a good thing. We just have to, you know, be better about moving on forward. So, as an offense, I'm sure you want to stay out there on those fourth downs, especially like between the quarters there on that one. Are you. You ever lobby Coach Edsel or something? You know, you know, we can get this or something like that. Or is it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah uh, no. Yeah. <laughs> I just kinda, uh, he's he's a head coach for a reason, yeah. so um, that's his job. And then I I just go play. So. What have the last few weeks been like for you with your injury and not playing? I mean, how's that whole process kind of been? Yeah, it, it was tough. I think you know it's it kind of sucks to get to get injured, and um, especially you kind of feel helpless because you're not out there with your guys, and um, you kind of see them putting in all the work, and you just kind of you know you can't do much, but. Um, it was definitely good to get back, and you know, it kind of gave me a different perspective on, on, on playing football, and you know how fast things can change, and, and you know, and, and people have your back all the time. And so, you know, it was, it was a great learning experience for me. Did you feel more comfortable today, having already played one game before, or how did this compare to your first game? Yeah, I felt really comfortable today. Honestly, I felt like I was seeing things really well, um, and I was, I felt like I was playing confidently. So. Mm -hmm. What can you do to help the offense, and including Mike Biardi at quarterback? <laughs> so, could me? What, could, what uh, can you do to help the offense with Mike Biardi um, at quarterback? You know, I think probably just execute better myself. Um, uh, you know, I, there's some things that I can do better, and I can communicate better, and I can help out these guys. And, um, yeah, I guess that's what we're going to do this week. Just going to try and be better on all, all phases.